Hello everyone. Another message has come through, so I'm coming on live to share it in my car because that's just what I'm doing. But um, I really want to keep my language. Well, I first want to go on this. Your link, your language is so powerful. What you say, what you communicate. Um, we all have so many thoughts that are going through our mind at any given moment. We all have so many things that we could capture. And when you're in that space of constant creation of constant ideas are flowing, or even like if you're angry and you have so many things you could say, it's like you want to capture the wording of what you actually desire to create in your reality. And so as you guys know, you know, about a, 10 days ago now, I had a really crazy experience happen in my life. I don't want to go into it, but you can, you know, go to my blog or you can go to my podcast and you'll see the story. Um, and it's been like a really interesting puzzle piece and it's been really hard to like stay positive. It's been really challenging to feel like something you've devoted your life to for the last three years, like in a deep devotion was hacked and was now portraying you to be someone that you're not and you have no one to call. There's no police force that is able to do anything um, because it's a virtual world and it's scary it's it's really scary to feel like there is nothing but this just like higher connection and higher source that you have a relationship with that is watching over you and that's giving you this life journey that feels like what in the f why is this happening to me or why did my life lay out this way and i've had that you know feeling a lot of times in my life not quite like this it's a little bit different but um you know so I, I'm doing all the things like I'm sending like handwritten mail things. I'm getting like fo- screenshots and photos and piecing my story together. Um, I contacted my Congress representative and Senate representative. I contacted, you know, the FBI. I contacted like all these people like and I go to go to like an in-person um, campus today to get a hold of a real person and to find out that the campus that I researched and found online, that is a false address that the, that a company places and that they have their employees somewhere else. Yeah. And now because of this, I'm about to go. There's five like small bookstores that I wanted to go to so that I don't know if they've heard of me or they've seen my book that's coming out, but I was just in DC and I went in a small bookstore and they um, bought my book right on site. So now I'm going to go to those bookstores and, you know, introduce myself and see if we can do like a little pop-up thing. But it's definitely very different for me. It's different to feel like that I'm back in like a brick and mortar sales than like a virtual world because it's like you've got to get up you've got to plan your time you've got to like there's just so many things to it where it makes me so grateful for the online world that you you get to impact people from where you are you don't have to like plan your day you don't have to like stop here and research all these addresses and figure out how they go together and it makes me just deeply grateful for technology it makes me deeply grateful for artificial intelligence it makes me deeply grateful for human connection (sighs) what else? Um, I think my message just is when you really have a passion for something, you guys, you'll do whatever it takes. You really will do whatever it takes. You'll get creative. The solutions will come. So I would, I would offer you as if, if you are desiring something in your life and it's not manifesting or it's not happening yet, the answer, the question would be, why don't you want it bad enough yet? Why don't, why aren't you deeply devoted to it yet? Like what, what's your triggering? What's your wounding with it? letting it a lot out there. Um, and I really do believe, you know, this is the power, the power of social media. I believe that social media is such a gift and such a tool. So, um, I highly recommend I have a three day social media bundle. It's on my website. You can go to my website and just, um, find it. It's like $111, but it, I really start teaching you why this platform is so important or why all these platforms are important because it, it, allows you to connect deeply with people without you having to like plan your whole life of addresses and people having false addresses and things like this. And it's in moments like this, you know, that's challenging for me even. It's like, oh my goodness. But 
I go, you know what? There's obviously a reason this is happening. There's obviously a deeper understanding for me. There's obviously a, a purpose. There's obviously a cultivation. So even when it's like, oh, I feel so frustrated. I feel like, you know, it's I was just so close. And then it was like, just kidding. It's like, just know that people are working in your favor. Everything's working in your favor. And there's a reason for every single thing. So, um, yeah, I just wanted to share that message. It, when you deeply care about something, you'll do whatever it takes. So if you don't have something in your life, you are doing whatever it takes. I would ask you, what would you, if you could live any lifestyle you want, you could have anything you want, you could create, you could be, you could express, what would you, what would that be? And then how do you start taking one step a day towards that one step a day? And even when things go wrong, because it's not like once you get more successful, things like go more right. Usually the more successful you get, the more things go wrong, the bigger the problems are. And you have to be able to navigate and move through them with grace um, so yeah. So anyway, I love you. I hope you're well. Please share this, go to my website and get the social media. And then if you're also struggling with like these high emotions when they rise, um, go to my website and get my mindset audio. It's $19. I love you.